and good morning people. Welcome back to Hyperdimension Neptunia Rebirth 2 Sisters Generation. After a load of cutscenes last time, um, we've discovered that Linda is posing as Chica and well, as expected, she's run off. We need to track her down. She's gone to the Underverse, so that's so where we're places. going. But Yay, this is my dream party. we're not going there for long. No, we're going in there. We're going to pick up all the items, and then we're going to leave. Okay, let's go. After well, the initial event because it's right there. We're not going to even fight the monsters. We're just going to go in, get pick up all the items, leave. But I think I put enough distance between us, so... Wait! Whoa! That's the most persistent fraud of the bunch! I gotta find something useful, fast! I don't see Underling! Where did she go, Mew? This is a one-way path, so I doubt we would have missed her. Be careful, something is over there. Doggoos. Doggoo! Doggoo-goo-goo! A lot of doggoos. What the goodness? A herd of doggoos? Look at all the Mr. Doggoos. They're on the floor, the walls, and even the dungeon ceiling. Oh, great. They aren't strong, but this many is going to be nothing but trouble. Blah! Doggoo! Uh oh! They're coming right for us! No! Please stay back! W what do these slime balls think they're do- Yikes! Hey, don't crawl on those! Yeah, um, they might be, um... Doing things. Icky, yucky, They're so slimy and slippery. Ugh. My cute outfit is covered in goo. Oh, stop tickling me! <laughs> That's for whiteies only. I taste very sour. I don't recommend eating me, you. Such perverse opportunists. I hate experiencing such levels of embarrassment in front of others. Stop it! That's my ticklish spot! <laughs> huh? N no! Bad doggoo! Don't you dare try to wriggle there! Damn you all! My dragon eye will doom you all to oblivion! Uh-oh. Ify just snapped back into her childhood delusion something fierce. I... I said stop! Please, I can't! I can't take this anymore! Stop letting yourself sound like perverts and help me kill these stupid things! Goodness, that was really, really embarrassing. I am amazed at the convenience that comes with such a swarm. One can do whatever one pleases. Like Linda running away. Oh, I'm nuts. Underling must have gotten away by now. If she ran directly here, then this is probably a secret ASIC hideout, Mew. Makes sense. I'm not going home empty-handed after that nonsense. Let's head a bit further in. And we will be. We want the items after all. There's... There's actually some fairly uh, interesting monsters around here, and apparently that one really wanted to get to me. But we're still going to come back for them. I just want the items here. Hmm? What's this? Clan for Gigatoxin, Flame Soldiers. Uh, soldiers? No, Shoulders. Mostly, it's, it's processor parts. We've already picked one up. 
we're going to be picking up pretty much the entirety of the flame set. We've got the flame, we had the flame hat before we started. We're going to be picking up the complete rest of it. What's this? There's also a studded bra bracelet there. Plus, I do also want the uh, materials. Yeah, Fermadite, I believe, here is actually one of the things that I'm going to need a few of later down the line. What's this? There's a studded armlet and the flame, uh, flame waste. I think that's everything here, so let's move on into the next one. There is one event here, it's just around the corner to the right. That is where we will be facing the boss of this area. There's also a save point there, but uh, yeah, the event's just over there. We will be ignoring that just like we're ignoring the enemies here. What's this? There's the flame back. And there should be one more. There it is. Mm -hmm. For the flame What's legs. This? And over in the corner there, there's one more gathering point which we can get without hitting the event. So we're going to do that. There are blue pe uh, I think those give the uh, give something up. Something for all the um, pigments, but I'm okay with leaving everything right Yay, now. This is my dream party. Uh, Plan-wise, the gigatoxin we can actually make already, so I'm going to create that and give it to Compa. Underverse, we need plum indigo pieces, which are from the plummet type em enemies. And the heat cloths, which are from one of the ghosts, I believe it's the male version. And I do have quests here to get get items and do monsters. Ah, uh, the blinkies, that's it. Miss blinkies, I believe, have some type of ribbon. But um, we're going to leave that. We're going to now then, let's get going. Use one of our eject buttons here. And we're not going to go there. Not right now. Um, I'm still a newcomer, but I'll do my best. We've got the cat here. Um, okay. So let's create that gigatoxin. Uh, I don't believe there's anything else that I need. Oh, sunflower pin. If I've got enough of that, I might as well make it. Still need some red petals for that, still need lily rank for that. Some glow grass, I'm not even sure where that is at the moment, but also don't have the lily rank. Yeah, I think we're good for the moment. So what are we going to do today? Well, I do have some other quests which are not related to the Underverse. We've got the Fenrir Sulfur, the Dolphin, the Ice Fenrir, the Elemental Dragon, the Flame Fenrir, and the R4I SDHC. I'm going to do a few um, dangerous monsters. I want a couple of levels. Level 25 is nice. Let's see what I can get out of the dangerous monsters. Plus, I also need the drops from them to um, create some of the plans to change the dungeon. 
So yeah, I do want to do them. Did I actually buy a gigatoxin for you? Um, I probably didn't. I didn't. Right. Leave it all to me. Yeah, because that is a quite a big improvement. Other than that, I think we're sort of ready to go. I am going to save before I do this because there's still the chance I might die. And if that happens, well, we're going back to the Underverse. So, what does the uh, flame set look like? Well, that is the entirety of the flame set. And we're going to use that for a little bit. Right, so off to the virtual forest steps. Let's do our best. First target is going to be the Fenris Sulfur. I don't think we actually need this one's drop. Um, I think it's the Earth Ripper that you get from this. Is everyone okay? Because we got it from a Fenrir earlier. But I do want to actually get it into my um, Nepedia and at least make sure that it is the Fenris, uh, the Earth Ripper. Huh, looks like a tough one finally appeared. So, Fenris Sulfur. I should be more than powerful enough now to beat this. Doesn't mean I'm not going to do HD form. And you're just going to defend. Yeah, that's a whole lot better than um, turn. what the 2,000 I did in the first. No, uh, I took in the first attack. <laughs> Attempt at this. It's my turn. So yeah, we're good here. Out of my way. Right. Out of my way. It's very much likely I could have done this quite a while ago. But let's do a bunch at the same time. Compa, finish this. We won, we won, we won. So avenge my cousin is complete, but I didn't get the item, so I need to fight it again. I'm gonna be invincible. So, yeah, I'll be back once I've actually picked up the item here from the Fenris Sulfur. We give each other courage. Yep, that was the Earth Ripper, so extra one of those. Now in play. So where next? Well, that's a good question actually. The virtual forest doesn't have a dangerous monster. The darkness 60 doesn't either. Um, the next place we went to was the endless zone, but that's got Fenris sulfurs in as well. So that isn't really a help. The Rebeat Resort next has the King Crabs, so I think we're going there next. Yay! This is my dream party! And if I remember correctly, I need two of their drops, the large okay, pincers. Let's go! So I might be here for a while just trying to get those. But that's fine. I'm, this is, um, I'm here for experience just as much as the items. And showing the monsters. I'm not running just because you look tough. You're actually very, very, fairly far away. It's my turn! I, I'll do my best! Processor units, set! 
Processor unit complete. If you're hurt, leave it to me. Well, work. Who wants to get beaten first? Right. Let's get started. Prepare yourself. Who should I play with? I am doing a little bit of a uh, rush attacks because I do want to gain an EXE drive, drive gauge. Plus, um, technically, I do need to actually show RED at some point. So, yeah, there is that. Uh, just defend again, Bumper. Overall, these, these little monsters right now, are, at least the ones from the start, aren't really that dangerous. It, once we get to something like the Elemental Dragon, uh, things are going to be picking up a little bit. Um, that was meant not meant to be a defend. Oh well. And as you can see, um, dangerous monsters aren't completely immune to stasis effects. Some bosses aren't even immune to that, so yeah. And you're done. This is my, no, our power. So 455 experience. If I wanted experience out of these two enemies that I've already faced, it'd be the Fenris Sulfur. But normal enemies later in the underverse at the moment give more experience so there's no point really grinding on these enemies but that's one large pincer i need a second now then let's get going this may hurt a bit it's time for your medicine i found the test all right shall we see red might as well exc drive R E D. She red uses all her weapons to the maximum potential and beats the enemy senseless. It's a magic attack, so it's not um, her true specialty, I feel. But let's see what she, how it does and what it looks like. Here it is! Yeah! No need to be shy! Then again, um, when it's an EXE drive gauge, even if it's not exactly your specialty, um, it hits hard. Yes, I did it. I'll take the level. Yes, it is Broccoli's turn. Um, she has picked up her EXE drive skill as well. Uh, Makura Bean. Um, I'm not entirely certain when she got it, but she's got it and, well... You know what? No, let's show it off.
Hopefully could have won myself, you. I'm not entirely sure how um, Broccoli remains so innocent during the entirety of that. She's obviously not. Um, but yeah, that's Makura Bean. Well, you. Neutral physical, so it actually plays off of her... I think it, uh, she's actually better at her uh, physicals. Yeah, by about 50 points, which... 50 points may not seem a lot, but it actually is a fair amount in terms of damage calculation, as far as I'm aware. So, yeah, especially when the multipliers, like the EXE drive gauge uh, skills, make it so. Anyways, I need to find this last pincer, so I'm going to just meet you once I have. <clears throat> okay, so that's the rebeat resort done we with the King Crab. Uh, let's just do these plans now so I don't forget. Uh, destroy symbols, so my symbol tanks will destroy enemies instantly. Or do, we're going to get it, but we're going to turn it off because I do want the fights. I'm pretty sure that if you use that, you don't get the experience. I'll have to look into that a little bit more. I'll, I'll test it later. Um, so we need a magic stone for that. We've got the add enemies for the endless zone now. So that's that's what I needed the second large pin answer for. Right, so Mid Company. Does that have any special item enemies? Where are we going? The R4I SDHC. Um that's an I'm gonna hold off on that. Uh, the reason being is it's a machine enemy. I don't have a whole lot of uh, magic power right now. Maybe once I get a, a mage or two in my party, I'll think about it. But right now, I don't think it's a good investment to do. Uh, the dolphin and the ice fenrir. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, let's go and do the dolphin. Let's see how things go with this one. Probably badly, but um, might as well try it out. I do want to go and save, actually. Now, let's get going. There is a save point here, isn't there? Yes. Just over to the side here. Actually, is there any items over here that I missed when the events actually took place. Just that one? Yeah, looks like just that one. I probably will want an EXE drive gauge for this. If I do, well, I'll come back to it in a moment. So the dolphin. I can go anytime. Um. Well. I'm first things first. That. CPU candidate next year has arrived. I can't wait. We are going to use Leave it to me. some. Uh, I'm not. I'm not against using SB skills if I need to when I uh, when I'm fighting these. At the moment, I haven't had had haven't had the need to. But if, what, if it does arrive, arise that I need to, I will use them. Actually, um, you're just going to fight from the front here. Yeah. Right there. I got you. Who should I play with? And definitely the poison helps. Uh, H and stuff. You are getting all three. Yes. Right. Oh yeah, that's a good hit. This should be okay. Do you want your shot? This may hurt a bit. This may hurt a bit. Don't hurt. 
and you're not doing too much damage and you only get in a little bit of guard points per turn yeah we're fine with this no need to get and bust out the uh, SP skills here at least not yet Yeah, let's do this anyway. Oh wow! <laughs> Don't judge me just because I'm only a goddess candidate. Two thousand three hundred experience. That's not too bad, actually. We've got the dolphin tail, which I believe I needed as well, and we've done the quest. And levels. So I do now, believe we're done here. Let's get going. Did I need that plan? You're the shampoo ear. You're the premium jelly. Patch him on circuit. Maybe? Maybe it's just something I'm not seeing right at this moment. Anyways, back out we go. Let's go and have a go at the Ice Fenrir. We're going to reach a point when um, enemies are just going to be out and out too powerful for me soon. Uh, the Phoenix I'm expecting to be power powerful enough to beat me, the Ice Fenrir possibly, Elemental Dragon likely, and the Flame Fenrir almost definitely. But Flame, fin Yay, Flame Fenrir dream, first. Sorry, Ice Fenrir first. I would like the Ice Gear back on Net Gear, wouldn't I? Yes. Do I look good? How is it? Okay, let's see what this is like. Ice Fenrir looks... I think it's like a little bit bigger than the uh, Fenrir Sulfur. And I think the claws on the front are a bit different. But, um... Prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. Let's see how things go. Poison helps immensely. Um, you're just going to hit from here, I think. I can go anytime. I'm sorry. I'll be serious now. CPU candidate Nepgear has arrived. Nepgear's got as much frost gear as I can on there. She still does have the flame legs on there, since I haven't found the f the frost legs. But that doesn't reduce her frost um, resistances down by nearly enough to make it matter. Uh, just defend there. No, it's not it's it. no health regen. So, looks good. It's my defend turn. again. Uh, ancient stuff. Yes. No. Not yet. Right. Let's get moving on. Breaking guard. My turn. Looks like I'm going to be able to do this one fairly easily. Although IF 
is in a little bit of um, a health situation. That's fine. Uh, healing glass yourself, please, I have. Compa, you should just focus on red. Heal time. Yay! Well, um, ow. Okay, you're gonna attack from behind here. Yeah, I think I'm. Yes. Although I'm able to beat this. I think I am starting to hit the limits of what I can do for these dangerous monsters. I can't wait. Uh, Compass in turn kit. We are going to go with Everyone that. Be healthy. And it's how did you? Turn. Okay. Okay, yeah, you do have ice attacks. Good thinking that I had on put Nepgear with some resistances to it. Prepare yourself. Who should I play with? Yeah. Yeah. Take this. Take. I can't wait. Okay, you are now broken. Um, you're going to in turn kit yourself and everyone it's else here. And Nepgear, you need to see if you can finish this as soon as possible. So the Magical Glacier Wolf has been completed, 3,500 experience. Yep. I'm gonna be invincible. So, yeah, I need to f get the item from that. Um, I'm still a newcomer, I but also, I'll do my best. I also need to check to see if there's actually anything special from these enemies, don't I? Uh, dolphin, there isn't. Uh, King Crab, there isn't. Uh, do, do, do. Fenris Sulfur, there isn't. Ice Fenrir is just its normal item, so okay, I think we're okay. I think we're good for this. I'm going to leave and come back in for the full heal, and... I'd be happy if you healed me. Yeah. I'll meet you back once I've got the item. We've seen the enemy now, we just need the item. Uh, is anyone okay? supposed to be this hard? There we go. Freezing Claws took a couple of attempts. Uh, experience. I'm happy with that. Yay! My level went... Let's keep this up! Numbing Edge. Ah, Paralysis. Slightly less power. Oh, very, very little oh, no, reduction in power. But Paralysis isn't a bad status. For me, at least, to use. Huh. Do I want to have a go at the at this Phoenix? Um, I really don't think I do. Ah, Kakira. Ah, Stella didn't make it. I was having given her a go at the um, World Labyrinth. So 
we'll have a look at what she's got in a moment. And I believe I saw a chirp lying around somewhere. Yeah. Okay. Let's have a report on these quests though. I think we're going to just uh, hold off on... Yeah, Phoenix, Elemental Dra Dragon and Flame Fenrir. I think we're okay without them at the moment. We can come back to them later. So, Fenrir Sulfur. The Dolphin, um, Spectral Back. Okay, we'll have a look at that in a moment. And the Magical Glacier Wolf, which gives us the Wasteland Waste. Oh, sorry, Legs. Those are the Sweet Shoulders, the Swimwear Waist, the Measurements Hat. Huh. We've still got a few things coming along. Leave it all to me. So let's have a look at these items. Spectral Black. A couple of scythes. Huh. Okay. And the Wasteland Legs. Interesting. Okay. That gives a bit of electric resistance, actually. Huh. Well, that's interesting. Why do we have an event in Planetune? Come on, let's hurry! I didn't get a medal, did I? go up in rank or something? Because I don't remember doing anything to get that. Unless that was from one, the uh, huh, the one that couldn't be replayed, and there was a medal there. That's a possibility. No worries, Stella. We'll just re-equip you up and see how you go. Okay. And a cat claw six. Yeah, brave sword is the one to go. Full plate. Luck goes down, but pretty much everything else is. Okay, um. Sage Stone with Vitality plus 16, Defense Against Wind, Steel No, Item Drop Up, okay, that's some interesting stuff, Blue Blocks, Green Blocks, Plummet Pieces, hmm, 
Sealed Calamity. I have no idea what that is, but it's not even the final enemy. Well, let's give you some um, ridiculous armor. Not sort of, I'm not really liking the luck problem there. So I wonder if we can fix that just by giving you the luck plus one here. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. We're just going to take the five hit. Uh, still going to keep the Rob Foe because that's giving us some extra items. Yeah, let's give her another go. Wonder if that's a killer sheen. Wow, pretty much got all the equipment already. Just this one that's missing that we've probably already got. Good luck. Okay, so that's done. We've done a whole load of um, dangerous enemies. I think next time we're going to go and have a look in the power level dungeon, um, power level island, just to get that sorted out. And then we'll head over to the Underverse to actually go and fight the enemies, um, do uh, do the quests that are there, and to well do the event. Let's progress the story a little bit more. So yeah, next time all that. Until then, have a wonderful day. Have lots of fun. Goodbye.